hello and welcome to another episode of it's about everything and in today's episode i'm going to show you how you can reduce the background noise of usb sound card or adapters now you can see i have two usb adapters one is manufactured by quantum and the other one is manufactured by terabyte and both of them actually looks the same only the name is different and i'm going to use my chat headset uh, microphone to record audio into my laptop so let's see so basically uh, this type of devices uh, creates a type of background noise that constantly it's like a buzzer it keeps on going so uh, in order to reduce that I have accidentally uh, discovered this technique and it's pretty simple just by grounding this uh, USB devices now there are better uh, brands of USB devices available they are a uh, little bit expensive and they don't generate that much of background noise if you adjust uh, the mic input gain but the cheaper one like this has a constant background noise and this technique will reduce it so I hope uh, this video helps you another thing that I've noticed about these USB devices is that they pick up uh, interference from the surrounding electronics such as uh, the adapter that connects your laptop to the wall outlet uh, it picks up that interference also and if you have uh, if you're running any electronics such as a fan or a washing machine uh, around then the, it will pick up that interference as well so these are really cheap and if you are not grounding it then it will pick up all of the interference however if you ground it then this interference gets neglected okay friends the audio right now you're listening to is coming from this USB audio adapter and if I keep quiet for a moment you will hear the constant background noise going on so in order to reduce the background I need to uh, ground this device because these devices are not internally grounded and the noise that is coming is generating from uh, a phenomenon called USB ground loop interference I don't know what does it means but there is a device available in uh, Amazon you can buy it to reduce that background noise it's called USB isolator uh, it's pretty much expensive than these devices so I don't think you will consider buying a USB isolator but if you want to do it uh, in a much more DIY technique then this is the way so this uh, metal on the USB plug they are connected and it's connected with the shield in this USB cable which goes on to my computer so in order to uh, reduce the background noise you need to ground this uh, to something in this case uh, just by touching it does the job don't uh, connect it to the mains uh, ground that is available in your wall outlet because that is much more closer to the high voltage and it might damage your device probably your computer so uh, don't use that ground instead just by touching it uh, it reduces the noise because your body acts as a ground and absorbs the excess uh, interference signal your body works as a ballast now this is a metal um, um, a piece of aluminium and I'm going to connect it just touch it uh, on the metal frame on the USB and the uh, and the background noise will be gone so just look carefully So you can see the background noise is completely gone. Now if I remove it, it again comes back on. So uh, your body here is acting as, I believe that it acts as a ballast or some sort of uh, a capacitor maybe and it absorbs the excess voltage uh, or the interference and that's how it becomes much more quieter so 
so let's try out the next one okay so uh, I've connected the second uh, USB adapter that I have which is by quantum and you can hear the background noise I'll keep quiet for a few seconds you will hear the background noise okay and in the same way the background noise uh, disappears when I ground it with this aluminum plate just listen so you can see the background noise has completely gone completely removed that's because I'm grounding the frame of the USB plug and you can hear how clear the voice is and actually uh, I'm actually recording the audio in audacity and I am not uh, applying any type of noise reduction or anything it's just directly recording I'm just amplifying uh, the sound so that you can hear the actual noise in the background and that's how it works okay so the uh, quality of audio is very low in this USB devices uh, that's because uh, they are very cheaply made and they are uh, most of them are made in China and they're not very high quality and the second thing probably it's because of my microphone because the chat headset that I've been using uh, I, I'm using it uh, since 2011 and it's very old and it's still working but the microphone probably lost its clarity so that might be an issue because if you connect a good quality microphone into this device probably it would it would work but uh, some there may be a little bit of uh, noise in the background and you can remove it applying this technique or just by uh, buying a USB isolator and you can hear a little bit of white noise in the background uh, the hiss which is everybody calls it hiss and I call it the white noise so uh, the white background noise uh, will remain because it remains uh, with the microphone that came with my laptop and the lavalier microphone that I have uh, that I have uh, shown you in my previous video so the white background noise will stay you can edit that out in audacity but other than that the the interference that you can hear in these devices can be removed by applying this technique it's a very simple uh, technique you can easily do it so friends this was it I hope this video helps you in solving your problems uh, if so then please do let me know in the comment box how did it solved and if it didn't solve your problem then also do let me know I will uh, do some more researches so this is the end of this video I hope you like this video if so don't forget to subscribe like and share my channel and thank you for watching
I'll see you next time.